Welcome everyone, I'm Martin Tyler, he's Alan Smith, and we're going to talk about this match today from the commentary position. Hi there, Martin. Yeah, and expecting big things here, there's a great atmosphere. Today's game, Manchester United against Manchester City. Well, first versus fourth today, and uh, the leader's thoroughly deserving of that position. And I think the fourth place team, they could be higher when you look at the talent at the manager's disposal. And uh, I think we'll be hoping and expecting better things to come in the final stages of this season. Scott McBeanie is the man with the whistle. Goal news from Stamford Bridge. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Chelsea. Three minutes played, 1-0. Thank you very much, Alan. They're passing it well here. He would have got into the clear there, but he's been stopped in his tracks. Well, there might be a break now for them. Oh, they were breaking away well. But in the end, the defenders snuffed it out. He's just got away in the nick of time. Sergio Aguero coming forward. Well, they could have done it, but it hasn't worked out that way. He's gone for goal. Neatly done by Nani in the early moment. Yeah, really good take. Added goals to his game now, hasn't he? And Nani has improved as a goal scorer to add to his other considerable attributes. He's becoming the complete package. Isn't he just Cristiano Ronaldo move over? So after the goal, we've opened the scoring here 1 0. Bananis. In goes Rio Ferdinand. Wayne Rooney. Good ball. Good reading of the play, anticipating the pass. Goal news now from Hull. It's a goal for Hull City. 11 minutes played, 1 0. Cheers, Alan. And here's the help arriving on his right. Wayne Rooney! Great. You can have a crack here. Excellent block by the defender. It's going to be easy for the keeper to collect. Sinclair. Clever play. Ooh, subtle little bit of skill. Need more back here to curb this piece of attacking play. Got to get more men behind the ball, I think. Rodwell. Quick ball. Good attacking play from the forward here. He's beaten the defender. Here's Rooney. Bale. Zabaleta. Colaro. Possession back with Manchester City now. The interception just in time. Here's Van Persie. Rooney on the attack. He goes for goal! Tried to keep it down, but it kept on rising. Flipped the bar as it went over. Here's Van Persie. Can he turn away from the challenge here? Pablo Zabaleta. Superb shimmy then. Well, when you want a player to beat the defender in a one-on-one, -on -one, he is that boy. This is the chance. He needed to be quick there. Urgent work from him, and he's uh, kept them out really on his own. And the and the shot's off. That equaliser was really on the cards. It was, and I think all his teammates half turning around expecting him to have scored, but he let them down. That's a great ball. He's got space, and it goes for goal. A goal! It's a goal, and it's a superb one. Well, how many players have they got capable of scoring? Too many for the opposition. There's nothing like seeing a player break away at pace showing so much skill and when he came to the finish he kept a cool head wonderful stuff and it's 2-0 here
Aguero. Great chance. And it ends with this shot. Manchester City have a corner. And he's met it with his head. Oh, it's into the net. And it's an own goal. Well, we restart here with a post-mortem still going on at the back, having conceded that own goal. Rooney. Oh, the defender cut that out in the nick of time. Now, company. Aguero. Fletcher taking over. Now Rooney. And they're pushing forward, trying to make a chance for this fella. Oh! Still. Well, they want to do that with a bit more determination next time. He looked very worried. Goal news involving Chelsea. Alan McAnally. It's the second goal for Chelsea. 37 minutes played. 2-0. Thanks, Alan. A good control under pressure. Problems here for Manchester City. They are problems that can be solved, but the longer it goes on, maybe the more desperate they might become. They've still got a few minutes. Got to be. It goes straight back to Joe Hart and catches it easily. Rodwell. Fletcher. They can bolster their defending here, maybe with a, an extra player or two back from further up the pitch. Running that Percy! And they've scored! No panic. Realised he got the opportunity and took it. Full advantage. Great for a team, isn't it, when you can have somebody hanging up the other end of the pitch to make use of that counter-attack. And it's 3-1, the goals keep on coming. Tried the back heel and unlucky, really. Goal news from Stamford Bridge. Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Chelsea. And here it is. Robin Van Persie. Oh, that's the post. And he heads it for goal. And he's managed to help his side out there, but it wasn't very convincing, was it? They're passing it well here. And he would have got it. Half-time whistle has gone. And it's 3-1 here. They can almost put behind them that own goal, Alan, because they're leading at half-time. Yeah, well, they can't afford any more mistakes like that, but uh, they've done enough up the other end, I think, certainly, to, to deserve their lead at half-time. And this is going to be a change here for the team that is leading, and it's clearly a tactical one to try and cement that winning position. Tom Cleverley. Clever play on the ball. Aguero. Aguero. Good pass. Maybe for Manchester City. And here's a shot now. And up goes that flag. And it's offside. And they're questioning the call. Well, they were playing a high line. They were taking a chance. But the linesman comes to the rescue. Rodwell. Kolarov. Good ball. It's a real opening here, and the shot at the end of it. That's a good try, beat the goalkeeper, beat the post. Rodwell. Michael Carrick. Aguero. Now here's a chance for a counter-attack. Can they make anything of it? They like to play on the break here, but it just hasn't worked for them this time. Opportunity. Well, he has a go. Better finishing required, in truth. 
Well, now they're behind. They've got to try and switch things around. And here comes a substitution. Nani. It's an advantage. The referee's blown now. And Winchester played the advantage. Didn't see an advantage. Taken quickly. Sinclair. Quick ball. And the, uh, the supporting cast are there to help. Full is it? I'm not quite sure about this injury, but a man who might be able to update us on it down on the touchline, Jeff Shreves. Looks to me as though the problem is his hamstring. He's feeling it, but at the same time, he's determined to carry on. And Jeff right up to the minute, as always. Here's Rooney. Well, Wayne Rooney can make goals, score goals, come back and defend as well. Oh, here's the shot. Oh, the bar's still shaking. That's really well done. Good defending. Read the intentions of the opposition there to make that interception. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. Sinclair. He goes for goal! Goalkeeper might... has a go with the volley. And it's a goal! They have been comeback kings in the past. Still a bit to do, though, this time. Well, they have. I mean, the opposition leading really should shut up shop, but uh, you can never discount this team. Well, he's looking around the goalkeeper, his defenders, because just when he wanted some help, it wasn't forthcoming. The full master of the striker, he was Johnny on the spot. Well, it's an enforced substitution. There's no doubt it's because of that injury. Well, it's a five-goal game, split 3-2. Rooney. Well, there might be a break now for them. Oh, he's through. Now Rooney, options available on the bench for the away side today. Well, he's still uh, trying to get on the ball, but he looks absolutely exhausted. Rodwell. The attack carrying a bit of weight here, and the defenders needing uh, some reinforcements. Tom Cleverly. Gonna get caught in possession. Shots on here. Oh, it's off the bar. Oh, in goes the cross. Well, they're working away here. Pass, pass, pass. Patient. Just probing for an opening. Contesting possession. Possession back with Manchester City now. Goal news involving Fulham. Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Liverpool. 78 minutes played. 3-1. Cheers, Alan. Well, time is ticking away. It's time for a change, and here it comes. <laughs> Javi Garcia. Some players limbering up for the away team. Substitution in the offing. Manchester City. Still one goal behind. And the defender's been called into question, really, by this attacking build-up. You would not have picked this situation with a pre-match prediction, I'm sure. Manchester City in trouble now. With each passing minute, the trouble gets more and more serious. Keeps it going well. And here's some support down the middle for it. Well, this could have ended his game. He seems to have pulled a muscle. This is the chance. And he lets fly here. They are putting their bodies on the line, the defending team here. Well executed. That's a vital stop. Well, they've got the throw. And possession again. 
It's time for some fresh legs here. Here's the cross. And the ball goes out for a goal kick. Nicely uh, done to keep on his feet and not just go to ground and hope he might get a free kick. His teammates... Robin Van Persie! Well, that's a fantastic clearance. He rose to the occasion and, and hits it. Excellent block by the defender. Ruiz. Nasri. Makes a challenge here. Bale. Here's Van Persie. Michael Carrick. And it's another attack from Manchester United. Oh, can he get it away here? Ruiz. And it's come to an end now as the referee calls a halt. It's a great game to win, a great way to win it. And I think the fans at least will be rubbing it in to their rival supporters. Well, I think the winning team was a little bit more fired up, actually, than the losers. They were the team that wanted to win this match more.